Les Mis, it's the story of a man who is very far from love. In fact, is consumed and created from hate. And over the course of his life, he learns to love and opens his heart and transforms his life. My mom played my character, Fontaine, when I was seven. I kind of realized early on that I had fallen in love with movies and that being a musical theater actress, which had been my original dream, was probably going to take a back seat to that. And so then to have singing be something that was so crucial in me getting this part and getting to play this part, um, it was unforeseen and, and really welcome. The similarities between getting ready for a, a part like Selena Kyle, which was very physically demanding, and a role like Fontaine, which was very vocally challenging, they had to get stronger for each of them. For Les Mis, I had to get into really great vocal shape, which meant that I could sing for hours and hours and hours without getting fatigued. One of the most extraordinary things and complicated things about this film was the meeting of the theatre world and the film world. Hugh and Annie worked out how to combine those two worlds and, and were really sort of role models in some way as to how to make this incredibly famous work have new life breathed into it. This movie is a story of, of the heart and it's incredibly emotional and so to be able to portray those emotions live the way you would with dialogue was an incredible gift. I think it allowed for uh, a much wider range of, of, of nuance and emotion to make it into the performances for everyone. I decided that I wanted to really do the physical transformation, really lose the weight, and, and really cut off my hair as opposed to wear a wig. I thought, let's get it real, let's get it raw, let's let's show that these are real people with, with real stakes. So what was amazing was watching her do that and then turn up on set and and using all that but still being able to perform to a level that was um, kind of unrivaled. It's been wonderful getting to revisit it as, as an adult and to see that all those things, they haven't changed. And you know how sometimes when you look back on things that you loved as a child and they don't hold up as well, this one, this one definitely does.